Pakistan is very well known in terms of social science. SIT is well known in terms of engineering, so I think this is a good combination, engineering and social science. They don't teach you from textbook, but they teach you how to adapt and make things in a logical way. He'll be taught, he'll be trained, he'll be tested again and again extensively. And it's more than like how you apply your engineering sense into your life. The value of hard work and determination. When I was in the US for my PhD study, I was a president of a student association and the Judith Lippmann Award, which is for the student who has been a moving spirit of the society. As of now, I am a chief of a family business. I have to lead many teams and manage them to work together effectively. As an industrial engineer at SIT, I have learned optimization, logical thinking, and systematic thinking. I think this is three important things in your life. SIT built students to have like a strong, solid foundation. It gave opportunity for me to continue my PhD. I think it's diversity of the student. That so many students come from everywhere. And one of my close friends, she's an Indian. So um, we, we working together like a team. With this, we study together and we do some activity together too. Faculty members, I think they are top of the class in the engineering school. I remember when I was a student, we have a lecturer from MIT to teach me. It's very difficult, but it, I, I feel very proud of I play in a soccer league at society. I cannot remember the result, but it doesn't matter. We enjoy it. The, uh, it's called student committee. So at that time, I was a treasurer, and also uh, I became the vice president of the student committee. Friendship among me and my friends. Friendship among me and my professor. Professor here, really helpful, guideline them where they should be. Students are in the environment that both incubate and stimulate learning, not just to teach, but to develop students. Gern Ban Yai. Did he so? Lược, mai, pit.